uh, work on the ground, that's another maybe eight years, but plus whatever we can uh, discover actually in exploration. And also, once we get the cash, once we get the capture, get operation running, the idea is to continue exploration near mine and find new targets and develop new open pits and just extend the life of mine. Talking gold today with Tucano Gold and here I have Philippe, which is an open pit consultant for the company. Could you please shortly explain to us, the viewers at home, what the plan is to start mining here again? Oh, sure. Well, right be uh, behind us we have AB1, that's the main pit of the starting pit for us uh, uh, resuming operations. It's the closest one we got to the plant right now, and most of the stripping has already been done previous to, the, uh, to our uh, operation stopping. So, Sorry to jump in here real quick, but sure. stripping is basically taking away the material around the ore, correct? Exactly, taking away the material, the, the waste material that doesn't have any value that is on top of the ore, so we, that's already been removed, so we're, we're ready to go right in the ore in the bottom. So the plan is we start over here, as you can see the pit is fairly dry, we, ha we have been pumping that right now. So first six months we just jump in there, take the ore out while doing some stripping on the west side over there. So once we finish the, the, the ore from here in six months, we should be ready to jump in the ore below that due to the stripping we have for the six months. So that's the first year operations. While doing that, we start doing the stripping in Urukum and the other pits. So once AB1 is finished first year, second year we go to Rukun, get the ore from there, and then as the, the sequence goes on, so we just keep the, getting the, uh, that, that mindset, getting ore from one pit, stripping the next one. So once the ore is done in, in one pit, we got the stripping done at the next, and so on, so on for all uh, the open pit, as we generate cash and get ready, prepare ourselves to go down to the underground. Yeah, because of course the company plans to go underground in Urukum North, I believe, yeah. if that's correct. Uh, will the company also be pre preparing for that while running the op open pit simultaneously, or is that only a hand standstill until you have to cash. It should be standstill a little bit. Uh, ideally, we should get that ore out while doing stripping on the bigger pits in, in Urukun. And while you get the ore on those pits in Urukun, then we're preparing to do the underground, maybe uh, third year, fourth year operations. But first, that the goal here should pay for the stripping of bigger pits in, in Urukun. All right. So if I understand the picture correctly, we roughly have four years of life of mine in this area uh, easily accessible. What's the plan after that? Well, then we got the Urukun, the, the under, uh, Urukun underground, that's another maybe eight years, but plus whatever we can uh, discover actually in exploration. And also, once we get the cash, once we get the capture, get operation running, the idea is to continue exploration near mine and find new targets and develop new open pits and just extend the life of mine uh, beyond what we have. So like I said, we have four years, that's, that's proven, that's what we know for sure, that's what we got on the plate right now. But once everything is starting and we got the cash and the capital to invest in exploration more, the idea is find another targets, develop those and get more pits to extend life of mine. All right, and um, I understand we currently have a very big plant, which is very much tailored to an open pit like this, sure. correct? And you've also acquired another uh, plant, processing plant from um, Pilar Gold, which is more tailored towards underground. Now, if there's exploration upside in the area, will there also be potential to run both at the same time in the future if you find resources? Exactly, that's one, one idea. We find new open pits and can continue supplying a steady, uh, higher volume of material to the plant, then we can operate both plants. The, uh, the concentration system for the plant that we're buying from Pilar is a gravitometric system with Nelsons and, and, and uh, gravinets, gravinets on the table. So the idea is process both, just try to get a cheaper, easier ore throughout the smaller plant. But if you get the volume, you can keep running the, the current plant at the same time. All right, makes complete sense. So I'll give a quick summary and please correct me if I'm wrong. Sure. There's a lot of material in these open pits ready to be processed on the short term. Then of course we have the underground potential uh, on the medium term and on the long term there's exploration potential in the area uh, which we'll have a video on with uh, Lewis, the lead geologist as well. Is that correct? Exactly that. That's Perfect. Thank you so much for your time, Philippe. Really Thank appreciate it. Thank you guys. It. Thank you very much.